once upon a time in a small town named Dreamland. Dreamland was known for its beautiful houses, friendly neighbors. From past few weeks everything was not right for Dreamland. Strange things were happening in Dreamland, as rumors spread about mysterious ghosts haunting the old abandoned mill near the edge of town. Lots of people have already seen the strange creatures and some would call them ghosts and some would call them aliens. To save the kids from any kind of trouble, parents advised the kids to stay inside home after 7 p.m. And once a busy town which was full of fun and excitement was deserted in the evening. In the dreamland there used to live a brave and curious 10-year-old girl named Amaya. Amaya had always been fascinated by mysteries and had a knack for solving puzzles. She liked to read detective novels and books and watch detective serials on TV. She couldn't resist the urge to uncover the truth about the ghosts that everyone whispered about. Determined to uncover the truth, she embarked on an exciting adventure that would challenge her bravery and detective skills. She started talking with all the people who had seen the ghosts. She questioned about the details and used to note them down. After talking with people she sat down in her room to study notes and started to connect the dots. One moonlit night, with her heart pounding, Amaya decided to sneak into the old abandoned mill. She walked through the deserted roads towards the old mill at the edge of the town. She reached at the main door of the old mill and started observing to find anything unusual. She went inside through the main gate and reached at the old and rusty door. Armed with her flashlight, she crept through the creaking doors, cautious of every sound. Her imagination ran wild with thoughts of ghostly apparitions. Its rusty doors creaked ominously as she cautiously stepped inside. Cobwebs hung from the ceiling and an eerie glow seeped through a crack in the wall. She saw another door, which was opening and closing on its own. She reached inside a room where cobwebs and bats hung from the ceiling. The air felt heavy, and eerie whispers danced through the darkness, sending a shiver down her spine. Amaya was able to hear some sounds, which were coming from the upper floor. With her heart racing, Amaya followed the sounds to an upper floor, where she discovered a hidden room. On peeping through the room, Amaya couldn't believe her eyes. It was then that she saw them a group of mischievous boys and a girl sitting and talking. She also saw the costumes of ghosts lying on the floor. Her eyes widened in shock and disbelief. Amaya understood that these kids pretend to be ghosts and scare people of the town. She had stumbled upon their secret hideout where they had been orchestrating the ghostly antics to frighten the townspeople. They had played tricks on the unsuspecting residents, causing fear and confusion throughout Dreamland. Her detective instincts kicked in as she realized she had uncovered a different kind of mystery. With a mischievous smile, Amaya decided to teach the kids a lesson they would never forget. She quietly retreated from the room, plotting a plan to expose their tricks. Amaya contacted Ella, her friend. Ella and Amaya together, they devised a clever scheme. Next day during the daytime when no one was at the old mill, Amaya and Ella went there quietly and installed hidden cameras behind the paintings and table lamp. They set up cameras around the mill to capture the boys in action, gathering the evidence they needed. As evening fell, the townspeople gathered for a spontaneous meeting in the town square. Amaya stepped forward, her voice strong and confident. She revealed the truth about the ghosts, unveiling the footage that showcased the boys in their ghostly disguises. The crowd gasped in surprise and disbelief, their eyes fixed on the boys, who were now blushing with embarrassment. The anger turned into laughter, and the boys were explained and made aware for their mischievous behavior. The mill, once thought to be haunted, was now a symbol of the boys' silly antics. The townspeople celebrated their newfound knowledge, grateful to Amaya and her friend Ella for solving the mystery.
From that day on, Amaya became known as the young detective, admired for her courage and quick thinking. Dreamland was no longer plagued by ghosts, and its residents could sleep peacefully. If you enjoyed the story, then please help to like, share, and subscribe the video. See you in next video with another interesting story. Until then, take care and bye.